In this video we will explain how discrete I.O. addressing is assigned to expansion modules in an XGB M-Type PLC. In the XGB PLCs, all discrete I.O. addressing is designated with the letter P. We will be looking at how the P addressing is assigned to expansion modules and how the discrete I.O. is addressed. The LS M-Type PLC can be configured with expansion modules for increased I.O. and enhanced functionality. In this example we are using a 16 input, 16 output model configured with 7 expansion modules. A total of 7 expansion modules can be added to the M-Type PLC. Slot 2 is the first expansion slot in the M-Type configuration. The first discrete address is P word 8 bit 0 and the range is P8 bit 0 through P11 bit F. The last character in the P address is the bit in hexadecimal format. In the configuration shown with an 8-point relay module in slot 2, the discrete bit addresses are P word 8 bit 0 through P8 bit 7. If an input module were installed in slot 2, the first input would also be P8 bit 0. Slots 3, 4, 5, and 6 are communication and analog modules. Although non-discrete modules, they are each allocated 64 bits of P-data in the configuration. If the Ethernet module is replaced with a discrete output module, the P-address range remains the same. The first discrete output in slot 3 will begin with the starting address of P12 bit 0. A 32-point digital output module is configured in slot 7. The starting address is P word 28 bit 0 and the range is P28 0 through P31 F. The 32 output points are addressed P28 0 through P29 F. Though every expansion module slot is allocated 64 bits, the physical addresses in each slot are dependent on the I.O. count of the discrete module. This concludes the explanation of expansion module addressing in an XGB M-Type PLC. For additional information related to the XGB PLC family of products, visit the links below.